quero estar mais próximo do teu olhar e viajar nesse mundo que só nós. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I honestly don't think I've ever been this excited to film a video. Recently went to Walmart and I found so many cute trendy pieces. Today's video is going to be a fall fashion try on haul from Walmart. Yes, Walmart. I was a little bit apprehensive about filming this video because when you think Walmart, do you really think like, oh, I go shopping at Walmart? Not really. I mean, it's like if you want to get food or if you're going in for just random stuff, but not really clothes, you don't really picture Walmart having trendy clothes. At least I don't. But I was on YouTube and I had been seeing a lot of videos of people buying fashionable, trendy Nordstrom dupes at Walmart and I couldn't even believe it. So I decided that I wanted to go to Walmart for myself and when I did, I couldn't believe all of the stuff that I was finding. So I thought that I would make a video for you guys in case you want to go to Walmart and pick up these pieces for your wardrobe. The first thing I'm going to talk about is cardigans. They had some really cute cardigans and I'm also going to mention the prices. So there is this cardigan here, which is $15.96, but I believe I got it for $13 on sale. And I also went back later and I got a black one because I felt like for the fall and the winter, who doesn't need a black cardigan? It goes with anything and it's also nice and long. So I feel like you could really dress this up. Not to mention the quality is so soft. I got mine in a size large, but the medium also fit me. But because this is a cardigan, I wanted it to fit me a little bit bigger. The next thing I got was this really nice knitted flannel. It's not really flannel material, but it has the flannel look. I also love the shape that this, I'm going to call it flannel, that this flannel gives you. It has a little pocket and I also picked this up in a large. I could have gotten a medium, but I did want this to fit a little loose on me. Out of all of the pieces I got from this Walmart fashion haul, I think this flannel might have been one of my favorites. And the reason is because it's a really nice size and it also covers your butt. So if you wanted, you can wear this with leggings. I also really like how it's not so tight. It's nice and loose and it also has a really nice shape to it. So it doesn't make you look boxy. I feel like some flannels make you look boxy, but this actually gives you a really, really nice shape. And I pair this with the black booties, but I'm going to show you guys how you can wear this with some mules as well. So these are the first mules that I wanted to show you guys how it looks with this. I feel like with these it would look a little bit more dressy because they do have the fake fur. And I can't forget the sunnies. And if you're not into fur, you can wear these regular mules with the gold detailing. And I'm pairing it with a black bag that also has some gold detailing. The next three pieces are thermals. They were only $7.96. I recently just moved from Orlando to North Carolina, so there is a very big temperature difference when we get into the winter. So I wanted to make sure that I was ready and stocked up for the fall. And these thermals are so warm. These were the perfect colors for the fall. I have a burgundy one, like this mustard yellow one, and then like a green one. So this would be for more of a casual look. I paired it with some black pants from Forever 21 and my mules from Target that are actually Gucci dupes. I really like to wear these for the fall because they keep my feet nice and warm even though they're kind of out. But they do keep them nice and warm because of that fake fur. And I really like the detailing of this shirt with the buttons and I like how, how nice and warm it keeps me. If it gets colder, you can wear a moto leather jacket with it as well. And I absolutely love wearing burgundy with leopard print. I feel like those two combine really, really nicely. This is how I would pair my next outfit, and this is with the green thermal. I do have the tags on these because I like to keep them on until I'm ready to use it. 
but I'm wearing these Cognit combat boots, these black pants. You could also use leggings if you wanted to and make it more comfortable. This green thermal and the flannel, the black and white flannel. Again, same detailing with the buttons and they don't open, same as the burgundy shirt. For this next outfit, I'm wearing the next color flannel that I got, which is this mustard color with this black cardigan. I think this looks so cute, and I really like how it looks with these black booties. I almost feel like it's so co-adhesant because um, of the black pants. It almost looks like I'm wearing um, boots that come up to my knee for some reason. It kind of just gives that illusion. I really like the pop of color in this outfit. The next thing I got was this layered necklace. I loved how dainty it was and it was genuine black onyx and I'm like, you know what? Let me give it a shot. It was only three dollars. Pretty excited about this find and they had a whole bunch of different metals. They had silver and they had gold as well. The next pieces that I'm going to talk about are actually boots. So I got some really cute boots at Walmart, surprisingly, because I've never really found good quality shoes there, but I really, really like these. I just realized that I wasn't mentioning the brands from all of the clothes that I got, but they're actually from Time and True. So these are some combat boots. I don't have anything like this in my shoe collection, and it's very different. I like the edginess of it, and I feel like you can kind of style this with anything and make it look a little bit more edgy, like a moto jacket or something, and I thought this was super cute. Um, and this was... $19.97. They also have them in black, but I really, really like this like cognate color. The next thing I got is probably the one thing that I am most excited from this whole fall haul, and it is these leopard print booties. How cute are these booties? I've seen these all over the place. I've seen them at H&M. I've seen them at really expensive stores, and they are expensive shoes. Now, these are like dupes, of course. I did get mine in an eight and a half. Now, I'm usually a seven and a half in shoes, um, but I had to get them a little bit bigger because I did wanna wear them with socks, especially in the winter. I wanna keep my toes and my feet nice and warm, so I did wanna wear these with some socks. Just keep that in mind in case um, you guys are going to get these booties. You might wanna size up. I really quickly wanted to show you guys how the leopard booties look with burgundy pants. As I told you guys, I love leopard with burgundy and I think pairing this with like a black shirt would look really, really nice. Got these black booties that are very, very nice. They were also $19.97 by the same brand, Time and True. So these are actually the same as these, just that they're a solid color. And I felt like I had to get these because you need a black booty in your wardrobe. I mean, I feel like it's a necessity, it's a must. I feel like it's like a staple. You know, it's like one of those things you need. I also forgot to mention that one of the one of the things I love about these booties is the heel. They're nice and chunky, but they're not very high. So they're very trendy and they're also very comfortable, which it's hard to find boots that are comfortable. I do have a wide foot. I forgot to mention that and I did get mine in a size 8. This is very weird too. These I was able to go a half size down, but in the leopard booties they were half size up. So I'm not really sure if these are made different, but I did just want to put that out there in case you guys are going to go on the lookout for these. I also got this little flannel dress. It kind of has like a flannel material and it's high and low. I got it in a size medium because it is a little bit big. It's a little bit tighter on your arms, but then throughout the body, it's kind of big because I guess it's supposed to be like a flowy dress. I really, really liked like the, the green and the black pattern. I thought it was perfect for the fall. Also, this color is very trendy for the fall right now. This is the dress. I really like this dress. It was very different because I don't really have any high low styles, but I thought this one was really, really cute. I also paired it with the combat boots that I got from Walmart as well. And one of the things that I like about this dress, it's very comfortable, it looks cute, something you kind of just put on. You could also cinch the waist with the belt if you wanted. And you could actually wear it as a cardigan slash duster over like some black pants and it would really spice up your outfit. 
I also like the pattern, the plaid. I think it's very in for fall right now. And I love how flowy it is. If you wanted to wear this as a duster, I'm wearing some high-waisted black leggings, my mules from Target with some gold detailing, and a tank top with some lace detailing that I got at Target for $15. It's like a millennial pink. You could quickly turn this outfit very blogger-esque with this nice fall hat, which I absolutely love. I really like pairing burgundy and like this green color together. And I feel like this cardigan adds a really, really nice chic look to it, especially with these black booties. I'm not sure where I picked this hat up. I want to say Target but I'm sure Walmart has them too. They're just these nice fall hats. Last but not least is the Nordstrom dupe. This was actually $12. I cannot believe it. It's Actually, the price on the tag says 1996, but on the Walmart website they have it for I believe 1288. And once I showed the cashier, she changed the price for me. And I did get this in a large, and the brand is Time and True. I did want it to fit a little bit oversized because that's how it's supposed to fit, and I could cinch it in a lot more. Um, as you can see, just for size reference, it does have pockets on both sides, and it has this little zipper over here, which I like as well, very comparable to the Nordstrom one. And I will insert a picture here so you guys can see what I'm talking about. And it is this kind of like nice Sherpa material, very, very warm, very comfortable, and super cute to wear. I want to thank you guys so much for watching my fall fashion Walmart try on haul. I really hope you guys liked this style of video. I really want to do more videos just like this, probably even at Target. So if you're interested, please comment down below. And, and also, I did want to thank you guys so much for the overwhelming love that I had received on my Instagram poll. As soon as I posted, um, I posted like a, a picture and a poll asking you guys if you'd like to see this video, and I had like a hundred and three. Um, people that voted yes. So I really want to say thank you for um, the love and support you guys are giving me on my channel and also on my Instagram. It does not go unnoticed. Thank you guys so much for watching this video and I hope to see you next time. Bye!